Survivability is a key consideration in anything that relates to combat operations. We've witnessed from our near-peer competitors their ability to reach out and touch from further away. One of the best ways to be survivable is to be out of range of the threat. The old days of receiving, staging, onward movement, and integrating a force into the tactical fight is going to have to be done much quicker and it's going to have to be done from dispersed environments. You have to establish a relative sanctuary, and the way you do that is move faster and deploy to dispersed locations. But when you are within range of the threat, you need to be able to react to the threat, whether that's threat to you on the ground or threat to you in the air. And the disruptive capability of a tilt rotor is one of those things that will allow that. Relative sanctuary is all about uh, speed and time and relative superiority. It all has to do with how quickly can you disperse, how quickly can you mass forces in certain areas and then disperse them all throughout the battlefield. Speed, as any aviator will tell you, speed brings safety. They're in the danger zone for a lot less time and they can operate from those positions of relevant sanctuary and it reduces that logistics footprint. You don't need to push out your forward arming and refueling points as far, in some cases, you wouldn't need to, period. If the ground force maneuver commander can operate and, and stage his forces from, or her forces from further away, that's critically important. They can't do that with the legacy fleet. And if they want to bridge that gap with the enduring fleet, they have to then set up other mechanisms to enable that, like farms. FARPs create other survivability challenges and logistics problems, and you're never going to completely eliminate that. You've got to be able to operate in that lower tier air domain at speeds that allow maneuver commander's options, at speeds that allow you to be survivable, and at ranges that you're going to be required to operate out of relative sanctuary into the fight. We believe that the tilt rotor is that solution. Our long range assault solution is the solution and will revolutionize the way the Army maneuvers. So the ability to fly twice as fast and twice as far allows you to stay outside of that danger zone in an area of relative sanctuary, but go forward, penetrate, exploit, and finish off the target and then get back out in a rapid way. That's the whole concept there.